kind of a long stage, but thanks, Matei. So today I'm here to show you why Unity Catalog is the only catalog built to understand your business. So first, we'll start on the new Discover page, the easiest way to find assets in Unity Catalog. Next, we'll drill into business domains and find some of my organization's certified tables. And finally, we'll show you how you see metric views centralize your business KPIs. Now, let's imagine that I'm a data analyst at our favorite CPG company, and my job this quarter is to dig in on marketing campaign performance. So let's go ahead and open up Databricks. And let's start on the new Discover page. This is the easiest way to browse and find your organization's trusted assets. Right away, we see things are grouped by business domain. So there's one for marketing, right next to partner insights and supply chain. The featured dashboards, queries, and tables aren't random. They're curated by our data stewards and then boosted by data intelligence signals, which you can actually see on the screen here with the sparkle indicator. So this lets us know that we're always getting the highest quality material for our work. So let's go back up and drill into the marketing campaign domain. Awesome. And here we can see everything is neatly organized. We have featured dashboards and tables. Let's look at the attributions one. Great, right away we can tell this is certified, so we know that it's a trusted source. And then opening up the description, we have a ton of rich information, like a sample query and this really beautiful visualization that helps us understand the overall data flow. We also get things like top user insights and then other related assets where this table is being queried. When we scroll up, we can actually drill into the data quality to check that this table is indeed healthy and fresh. So let's now take a look at the sample data. And at first, this is really overwhelming because it's just a ton of different IDs. But fortunately, Databricks Assistant right here prompts us with queries in natural language. So we get SQL started right away. And here, with what I'm highlighting, I can tell this has more to do with marketing leads than it does with marketing campaigns. So this isn't the right table. Let's favorite it for now and drill back in on the Discover page. So we're looking for business metrics. So let's filter down to metric views. So with UC metric views, my organization can define our key KPIs once, govern them in UC, and then access them from anywhere in Databricks. No hopping out to other wikis or copying queries. Let's take a look at this one. Okay, bingo. This is not only certified, but take a look. This is also the KPI for revenue driven by marketing campaigns. So this is great. Since it's a metric, it comes predefined with different measures and dimensions, so we can splice and dice the data however we need. And since this is all in Unity Catalog and on top of the Databricks platform, we can get started really easily. So let's create a quick query right now. I'm just going to press that. OK. And let's add in campaign name so that we have friendly IDs to join this with. And I'm going to rerun. And then let's visualize it because I'm a visual person. And all right, here we have, it looks like our smoking gun. The influencer campaign is underperforming against all other campaigns in market. So this is definitely something that we'll want to pass along to the rest of the marketing team to be able to dig in further. So there you have it. In a matter of mere minutes and with the Discover page as my guide, I was able to locate our organization's trusted and certified assets, drill in by business domains, and then tie real revenue impa impact back to business KPIs. So you know what? I think with that, my job here is done. Back to you, Matei.